Hi, this is Beth Beard from MyLittleCraftBlog.com and yesterday on my blog I posted these little 3x3 cards that I made using the Windows Framelits. Um, how I cut those is I took a piece of basic black, car black cardstock that measures 3 inches by 6 inches, scored it at 3 inches and folded it in half. I took the third largest die and lined it up on the front of the cardstock leaving this section here overhang and then just ran it through the big shot. Then I took the second largest die to cut out the designer series paper for the front and another piece of cardstock for on the inside. So today I'm going to show you how to do the envelopes. The first thing I have is a piece of designer series paper and that measures four and a quarter by six inches and that's from the house tooth and scaring bone collection. We're going to score this at a half inch and then do a half inch on the other side and then in the land or portrait landscape position we're scored at three inches and when you're scoring your designer series paper you don't want to push really hard with your scoring blade because you can tear it so now we'll just fold on the score lines we're going to cut this section I'm going to cut this section off. It's kind of hard to see on the dark paper. And then we'll do the same for this side. We're going to notch these corners. And then we'll just add some adhesive. And then we'll fold this in half. And then I've got my corner rounder, so we'll round these edges. In a three quarter inch circle punch, I'm going to just line this up and put it in about halfway and punch that out. And now we'll decorate it. Uh, the stamps we're going to be using are the little bats and Spooky from the Wicked Cool stamp set. And I'm going to stamp those in black stays on. And lastly, I have some basic gray striped ribbon. This is from the Holiday Catalog. We'll tie a piece around here. And I'm just going to tie this in a little knot. And since it's striped on the one side, not the other, I'm trying to twist the ribbon as I pull it through so I get the striped edge on top. I'll trim the edges. Let's straighten it out a little. And we'll open up our envelope. And that's it. So if you have any questions, let me know. Thanks.